Hello second grade, this is module one, lesson four, and our objective objectives for this lesson is I can make a 10 to add within 20. So this first activity we're gonna do is real quick. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you this picture of these 10, 10 blocks, and you're going to tell me how many they are. So remember, the these sticks are worth 10 and the blocks are worth one. So go ahead and write down your answer, how many blocks I have here. Did you write down 24? If you did, excellent job. Give yourself a kiss on the brain. Here's your next one. Go ahead and write down how many blocks you see. Did you write down 42? Good job. Your next one is here. Go ahead and write down how many there are. Eighteen. I hope you wrote eighteen. Here's your next one. Push pause if you need to. If you need more time to count, that's fine. Go ahead and write your answer. Did you write down 81? If you did, excellent job. Give yourself a kiss on the brain. Okay, so now this next activity, I'm going to say a number and you are going to say how many more we need to make the next 10. So, um, our first number here is gonna be nine. How many more do we need to make the next 10? 10. Let's see what our rocket sh ship says. One. Did you say one? If you did, give yourself a kiss on the brain. Good job. So now we need to make a number sentence. And our number sentence is going to look like this. Nine plus one equals ten. Now let's see if you can do this next one. So our first number is eight. How many more do we need to make the next 10. Write it down. Okay, let's see what our rocket ship says. Two, we needed two more to make the next 10. Go ahead and write down what our number sentence would be. Push pause if you need to. You should have written down eight plus two equals 10. Let's see what our next one is. Six. Okay, so how many more do we need to make the next 10? Go ahead and write down how many we need and then write down the number sentence. Push pause and then push play when you're done. Our rocket ship says four. Is that how many you wrote down? I hope so. And did you write six plus four equals 10 for your number sentence? If you did, give yourself a kiss on the brain. Excellent job. Okay, here's our next one. <gasps> 19, oh my goodness. This is a little bit trickier. So think about what the next 10 would be. So 19, Plus what would make our next 10? Let's see what the rocket ship says. One. We need one more to make the next 10. What would the next 10 be? 20. Good job. So, what would our number sentence be? It would be 19 plus 1 equals 20 because the next 10 from 19 is 20. Let's see what our next one is. Next number is 39. Okay, so write down what, how many more we need to make the next 10. So you need to think, what is the next 10? And how many more do we need to make that next 10? So go ahead and write down how many more we need to make the next 10. Push pause and then push play when you're done. 
Did you say one? If you did, excellent job. So now write the number sentence. Push pause and then push play when you're done. Is this the number sentence you wrote? 39 plus one equals 40. The next 10 from 39 is 40. And then you only need one more to get to 40. So I hope this is the number sentence that you wrote. If it is, give yourself a kiss on the brain. Hey, here's our last one. Let's see if you can get it. 85. Okay, be careful. Write down your the next number for the next num the next 10, sorry. And then write your number sentence. Push pause and then push play when you're done. Let's see what the rocket ship says. 5. Did you write down 5? And did you write down 85 plus 5 equals 90 for your number sentence? If you did, awesome job. Give yourself a kiss on the brain. Okay, so here's our application problem. Mark had a stick of nine green linking cubes. His friend gave him four yellow linking cubes. How many linking cubes does Mark have now? So what we need to do is we need to first think about, are we going to subtract or are we going to add? Think about that. Are we going to subtract or are we going to add? Correct, we're going to add because he has nine and then he gets four more. So let's go ahead and put, that, put up his nine green linking cubes here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then he got four more for his friends. So let's put those up. One, two, three, four. And how can we solve this? We can, of course, add all of these up. We can count them one by one. Or we could also write out our number sentence. So we could write nine, because there's nine linking green ones here, nine link green linking cubes, plus four more would be how many? Did you say 13? Excellent job. So here's another way to look at this. So it says, let's draw to solve nine plus four using circles and X's. So let's get our nine circles. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna make these in a group of groups of five. So here we go, one, two, three, four, five. Let's start our next group, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, so now we need to add our X's. And we need one X up here to make our group of five. So let's add one. And then let's start our next group. Two, three, four. Okay, so let's write our, our um, number sentence out over here again. Nine plus four and if you notice we made a tens group here so we needed to borrow one from the four here so we have a one here and we're going to give it to the nine which then we have three left over because we took one away from this four and we change this 9 to a 10 because that's the closest 10. Or that's the closest 10s is a 10 from 9. Then we change this 4 to a 3 because we gave that 1 over here to the 9 to make it a 10 to make it easier for us to figure out. And so 10 plus 3 is 13, which also, we could say 9 plus 4 equals 13. Okay, so here's our next one. Let's try this one. So let's group it by fives again. So we have 9 plus 6. So 9, let's put our 9 circles. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 
Let's start another group. Six, seven, eight, nine. And we're going to put one X over here, one of the six from over here because we need to finish that group of five up there. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so we borrowed, we put one X from this, uh, the sixes over here to make this group. So we take one six, one away from the six, give it to the nine, and now we have five X's left over. So we're going to change this nine to a ten because we gave that one to the nine to make it a ten. And we changed the six to a five. And we have fifteen. So again, you have the group of ten here plus your five ones over here. Let's see if you can do this one. Go ahead and push pause and then push play when you're done. Okay, so let's see if you did this correctly. If you did it like I did. So now we need eight circles. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. There's one group. Let's start another one. Six, seven, eight. Now we need to finish up our groups of five, this group of five here. So we need to add two X's there. One, two, and there's three right there. So now we need to break up this three here. So we, we had two X's over here. So we put the two right here and we give it to the eight so that we can make 10 and then we have one X left over here and we change this eight to a 10 and we change the three to a one. So 10 plus one is 11. If that's what you got, give yourself a kiss on the brain. Excellent job. Okay. How about do, how about you do this one also push pause and then push play when you're done. Okay, let's see if you got the same answer as me. So we need eight circles again. One, two, three, four, five. Let's start another group. Six, seven, eight. And now we need to finish up this group of five here. So we're gonna give one, two X's from the five to make this group of five. And then we'll go back down here. We got two, three, four, five. Okay, so we gave two to the eight and we have three left over. So we're gonna change this eight to a 10. There it is. And we're gonna change this five to a three. So our answer is 13. If that's what you got, give yourself a kiss on the brain. Excellent job. Okay, so now you're going to do this um, seesaw problems. There's two here from your for your exit ticket. You're going to first erase all everything off of your dry erase board or your desk. And then you're going to solve these two problems. And you're going to seesaw the your um, problems to me after that you're going to after I check it you are going to um, do your app your um, problem set good luck